how to make a headboard with mirrors. Hey guys, YouTube Essentials here. For today's video, I'm going to be starting off with Walmart mirrors. And I'm going to be using three to start off the project. Now with these three, I'm going to be using tape on them to make a pattern. And you can use strips cut from a contact paper or washi tapes. But what I'm going to be using is something similar to a washi tape. And I'll leave a link for this down in the description box below. After attaching the first set of strips, the next thing I'll do is measure out 18 inches and add two more strips on one side and two more strips on the other side to give me the pattern that I want. If you're new to my channel, it's so great to have you here. Now, don't forget to click on the subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my latest videos. I'll be repeating the same thing that I did for the first mirror to this mirror. For the mirror in the middle, I'll be repeating the same thing that I did for the first and second mirror, but the pattern that I made at the bottom of the two mirrors will be repeated at the top for the mirror in the middle. I'll be using Dollar Tree confetti to decorate the mirrors. I'll be using just the gold and I'll leave the rest for another project. I'm also going to be using Mod Podge and I'm using the gloss Mod Podge. I'll be decorating some of the shapes on the mirror with confetti. I used six packs of gold confetti from the Dollar Tree to cover up what I have here. And while this is drying, I'm going to be using crystal buttons on these points. I got this from Michael's Craft Store and I'm going to spray paint it gold and keep it aside. I shook off the excess confetti and this is what it looks like when it's dry. And I'll be using command strips to mount them on the wall. That way it won't be too heavy and I can remove them when I'm tired of this headboard and use it as a wall decor on other walls in the home. I mounted each piece for this headboard one after the other. I later added white sheer curtains to the sides to keep it white. That way the gold will look better. I mounted the headboard this slow because the bed is not on the wall. It is away from the wall because the bed is an adjustable bed. But if you like, you can definitely have yours mounted high enough where the bed won't touch the mirrors. 
Like I said earlier, when I'm done enjoying the feel of this headboard, I'm gonna use it as a regular wall decor on a different wall because I really love the design. The mirror on the right looks different because it was spray painted and now that I see it, I will definitely change it. I hope you all enjoyed this video and had a lovely Christmas. Now I'm wishing you all a prosperous new year. Thank you all so much for watching. I have other home decor DIY videos that are linked in the description box below to check them out. And don't forget to click on the subscribe button.